Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is in Wirecast. I am using version 12.1.0. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to switch from the preview window, which is what I'm in right now, over to the live broadcast area. So you get everything ready in the preview window, and when you're ready to share it to your live viewers, you switch over to the live broadcast area. So the first way to switch, you use the go button. If you hover your cursor over the go button, you'll actually get a full description of what it is. But the first thing you want to do is select the transition. So select one of these two buttons and then select the transition. I'm going to use this grid wipe. And when I press on the go button, whatever is in my preview window is going to be sent over to the live window. So here I go. I'm pressing the go button. I have the grid wipe selected. And now you can see it just went from the preview window over to the live window and it is the live window what your live viewers are going to see on YouTube Live, Facebook Live, etc. I'll show you the go button one more time. And this is what it would actually be like if you were doing a live stream. So over here in the preview window, this smaller camera view, nobody can see this yet. People can only see what's in this live window now, the big view. So what I'm going to do is select the second transition here, the circle wipe. And again, I can select any one of these down here. I'm going to select this button. You can tell because it's highlighted. I'm going to press on the go button. Now it's going to take the preview window. It's going to use this circle wipe transition and it's going to put it over into the live view window. So here we go. I'm pressing the go button and there you have it. So the second way to make the switch is using keyboard shortcuts. The keyboard shortcut for the go button, so rather than pressing the button, the keyboard shortcut is command G. And you can find that up here in the switch menu. You'll see this first one, command G. And if you want to switch between the transitions, command one is going to give you the first one and command two will switch over. So whatever transition is selected, when you press on command G, it's going to switch from the preview window over to the live window. So I have the grid wipe selected, command G, now you can see it switches over from the preview to the live window using this transition that was selected and using the go button keyboard shortcut, which is command G. And the third way, my favorite way of making the switch from the preview to the live window is using the space bar. The only difference between using the space bar and using the go button or the command G shortcut is that the space bar only looks at the transition that is set on the right side. It ignores this transition button. It only uses whatever is set right there. So I usually keep this one to smooth and use it as my default. So when I press the space bar, you're going to see it goes from the preview window. It's going to make a smooth transition over to the live window. So here I go. Space bar. Smooth transition, and you can see it right there. So the recap. To make the switch from the preview window to the live window, you can use the go button. You can also use the keyboard shortcut command G, and you can also use the space bar. My name is Mike Murphy. That is your quick tip in Wirecast 12. Cheers.